Hey folks, welcome back. In this video, we're going to go over two worked examples to show you how to do problems involving the Kelvin temperature scale. Now, if you haven't already done so, check out my previous video covering the theory on this topic, and that way you can apply what you learned in that video to this one. So let's get started. Question 1 says to change the following from degrees Celsius into Kelvin. Well, remember, when you want to calculate a temperature in Kelvin and you're given values in degrees Celsius, you need to add 273 to the values in order to get the temperature in Kelvin. So all we're going to do here is add 273 to all of these values. So in part A, 0 degrees Celsius is the same as 273 Kelvin. Minus 273 degrees Celsius add 273 is the same as 0 Kelvin. 100 degrees Celsius add 273 is equal to 373 Kelvin. 22 degrees Celsius add the 273 is the same as 295 Kelvin. And lastly, 250 degrees Celsius add the 273 gives you 523 Kelvin. Lastly, question 2 says to change the following from Kelvin to degrees Celsius. So we can actually rearrange the relationship we had before. So if we're trying to find the temperature in degrees Celsius when we're given values in Kelvin, we actually need to subtract 273 this time. So for all of these, we're just going to take away 273 from our values. And feel free to use a calculator for that. So for part A, 300 Kelvin minus 273 is the same as 27 degrees Celsius. 150 Kelvin minus 273 is the same as minus 123 degrees Celsius. 5000 Kelvin minus 273 is the same as 4727 degrees Celsius. 267 Kelvin subtract 273 is the same as minus 6 degrees Celsius. And lastly, 4 Kelvin is the same as minus 269 degrees Celsius. That's all for this video, folks. I hope you found it useful. If you did, give it one of these, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.